Hi, I'm Corey Mason, and joining me today is District Nursing Supervisor and Coordinated School Health Coordinator, Mandy Thompson. We're talking back to school, and Mandy, as our families get ready for the start of a brand new school year, what are some things that you'd like them to know? First thing I really want them to know is that I have 55 very excited school nurses that are going to be coming back to the clinics and helping out to help manage communicable diseases and all their child's health care needs. Our nurses are fantastic, are they not? They are amazing. And this year, this past year, years prior, I believe a lot of the success to managing COVID was because of our school nurses and what they did and how they contributed. Talk about the illness guidelines, because I know those are so important. We've just updated the illness guidelines um, because they allow parents and families to know when it's okay to send their child to school. Yes, and you know, parents really do know when their child is not feeling well, um, but there's always that gut feeling of when you're not sure. So the illness guidelines are set up in a bullet point um, format so that parents can truly look at the different illness and where they meet criteria. And if you're questioning it, always call the healthcare provider. I know our schools get the question a lot um, from families knowing about medication and what is okay to bring to school and what requires a doctor's note. Can you talk about that? Yes, so we have a Williamson County medication authorization form and every medication that comes into the school, prescription, over-the-counter, emergency medications, everything requires written authorization. And then when it comes to prescription medications, it is imperative that they have a physician's authorization on file with us in order for us to administer those medications in the school. Excellent. All that information can be found on the WCS.edu website under Health Services. Thank you, Mandy, for joining us. You can find more back-to-school information on our website as well at WCS.edu.